This is a 2010 Land Rover Range Rover Sport HSC. Got 55,000 miles on it. Uh, good tires, blacked out wheels. Let's see, right there, that's some dirt. I tried to go to the car wash, but they're actually closed due to Corona. But you can see that's dirt, wipe away. But anyway, it's got this little dent right here on the roof. You can compare it to my thumb. Uh, I had it quoted at a body shop here for 175, and that's if they paint this panel. You're also looking at about the same price if you want to do paintless dent repair, which is when they pop it out real good, but they don't paint nothing. But I like to edit repainted when I do my dents. Uh, let's see, coming around to the back, pretty clean on the back. This is where the spoiler is broken off. You can see these are the bolts that they went on. That's the wire for the lights and the and the and the little windshield wiper fluid that comes out of it. So that all plugs up into your new spoiler. You just take off those four bolts from the inside and reapply it. This is it on the back, pretty clean. Uh, the trunk opens two ways. You can pop it right here. Open it up like that, just the top half. Or you can pop it right here and open up the whole thing. And then when you're in the trunk, you got this little, uh, this little cover. You put that back, and that's your trunk right there. It's got to vacuum it out. We got some dust. Nothing special. Coming around to this side. Let me back up a little bit. Everything looks pretty good on this side. Uh, let's see. It's got one mirror cap missing, which I ordered. So that's gonna come with it. This is the front end. It's got just the auxiliary lights on, not all the lights. That's why you see those little circles around the headlights on. It's got headlight washers. So when you do your windshield wipers, those come on too to wash your headlights. It's got the fog lights. It's got pretty good tires. It's got the front parking sensors, as well as in the rear. You got the keyless entry when you hit this button. You can unlock and lock it. Power folded mirrors when you lock up the car. Let me get in and show you a little bit more about it. <clears throat> okay. So keys in my pocket. You already know this. You just hit the brake, hold the start button. Starts up. So you see 55,000 miles right up here. These controls, this is volume up and down for the radio. This skips, if you got a CD or aux, this skips to the next song. Or if you're on the radio, it goes from like your first save station to your second save station to your third one. These two are the horn. This is cruise control. That's how you set it. That's how you resume. This one goes up in speed. This one goes down in speed. Can is for cancel. Answer the phone, hang up the phone, Bluetooth commands, heated steering grill on, off. This is to go through the menu. So these up and down and okay, mess around with it right here. Show the warnings, vehicle setup, trip computer, display settings. Over here, you got your vents and all that stuff. Let me start off with the basic stuff before we go into the complicated stuff. Uh, well, I'm gonna stop this video and start another one because it's getting kind of long. 